Over on the Space Coast, SpaceX's Dragon cargo spacecraft splashed down off the coast of Florida this morning. The craft undocked from the International Space Station yesterday morning, carrying 3,600 pounds of scientific experiments spanning six years back to Earth. This was the 28th time SpaceX has launched to the ISS. They're getting pretty good at it. Tomorrow, SpaceX launching Falcon 9 rocket on a mission for the European Space Agency. The Euclid mission includes a telescope and two scientific instruments designed to explore the evolution of the universe, making a 3D map of the universe across more than a third of the sky. Quite the undertaking. SpaceX has been busy this year, and the company has no plans to slow down anytime soon. After launching 61 flights last year, the company set a goal to launch 100 times in 2023. All new at 5, News 6's James Barbero is checking in on the company's progress so far this year. Three, two, one, ignition and liftoff. This Falcon 9 rocket launching from Cape Canaveral last Friday, marking the 44th SpaceX mission through a record-breaking first half of the year. Falcon 9 has successfully lifted off. Now the challenge for Elon Musk's team is to ramp up the success even more if SpaceX can realistically reach 100 launches this year, as Musk said as its goal. They're on track. Certainly seems like they can get to 80, maybe 90. I don't know about 100. It'll be real close, but it's a phenomenal pace. Over 50 missions are on tap from July through December, including Saturday, the scheduled start of the six-year Euclid telescope mission to study what scientists call the dark side of the universe. So Euclid is a mission that is a cosmological mission, is looking back 10 billion years into the past and the evolution of our universe. The most powerful rocket in the universe, another test flight of Starship, is another of the high-profile SpaceX launches in the second half of the year. With Starship's first fully integrated flight in April ending in an explosion, this week SpaceX conducted a test firing of the next Starship spacecraft that will launch. Despite launch pad damages from the first attempt, Musk says the second test flight could happen in the next two months. Saturday's launch is now scheduled for 11.12 in the morning, and we'll stream that first launch of July on ClickOrlando.com. In Brevard County, I'm James Sparbero, getting results News 6. Busy, busy. They're going to do it.